Okay, hello there and Florida Beauty. It's your girl Eunice Marie here. And so today we are going to be talking about how I stay looking so young. I get this question a lot and there are a lot of different factors, some in which are not in my control necessarily and some which are majority which are in my control. So I'm going to share with you guys that today if you are new to my channel, hello my name is Eunice Marie and my channel is all about informative beauty from skincare, hair care, makeup, DIY, all that fun stuff. If you're not subscribed to my channel, what are you waiting for? Go ahead and click that subscribe button, turn on your post notification bell so you're notified when I upload and if you like what I do here on my channel, give your girl a big thumbs up and share me with the world, okay? So let's talk about it. All right, so um, a lot of times when I meet someone, uh, whether it's at work, whether it's out about, out and about, um, usually I get that question of how old are you? Um, and so usually when people think or people uh, see me and they guess my age, I get anywhere from about 17 to 22 years old. I even got somebody who thought I was 16 years old, okay? Um, and at first, it's annoying like I get it a lot of times I think like oh my gosh like why do I like a freaking child to people like I'm a grown-ass woman but then on the flip side it's a very great thing and so a lot of people ask me that question especially women after finding out how old I am which if you guys don't know I am 30 I will be 31 um June 1st so in a couple of months but I get that question of why how do you look so young like what are you doing to look so young the first factor with looking young is genetics you have to understand that um your parents your family your great grandmothers your grandmothers like genetics falling down like a lot I know my siblings all my siblings we all look under the age of 25 like we don't look our ages at all we look like a bunch of freaking high or middle schoolers um and that's just genetics it's just how it goes you know it's, it's just that we age gracefully which is a blessing Secondly, I definitely have to say it is what I'm doing, like my skincare routine. You guys know all about my skincare routine. I share this with you guys multiple times on how it is very important to take care of your skin, moisturizing, cleansing, using wholesome products, natural products to keep your skin looking um, as good as it possibly can. And you guys know like wrinkles, dryness, um, even stress, things of those things can cause you to age. So uh, just making sure to have a right skincare regimen is key to having your skin stay as youthful as possible. Okay. Um, another thing too is what you consume. So, you know, your waters, your fruits, your veggies, eating right from the inside out is the best way to support your overall skin so that it looks its best. If you are not eating correctly, if you are not getting your vitamins in or your nutrients, your minerals, all that, then your skin, your nails, your hair are the last to get it. So your body's going to stop producing those things to make sure that your organs are getting exactly what they need so you can survive, right? So if you are getting enough of your nutrients, you're going to look good on the outside as well. But for me, those are just the main key things. I mean, genetics, what I do with my skin, what I eat. I make sure I push water. I make sure I'm taking my vitamins. I'm making sure that I'm just overall taking care of myself so that my skin can look its best. Um, it's it's it always shocks me too because I feel like I come off a lot older than that but usually I still get that when, when I tell somebody my age they're like shut up like you're, you're you're lying you're not 31 you know like they they do that all the time and so um it's not a bad thing not at all you know it's a definitely a good thing and hopefully I look like this until I'm the age of 80 but um I just wanted to answer that question because it's a question that I get a lot and it falls into the beauty world as well because women want to know what can they can do to stay as youthful as possible especially when you start to hit the 30s okay all right when you start to hit those late 20s those 30s you know women we are eyeing every little thing on our face and going okay so where'd that line come from okay so where did you know that blemish come from where did that freckle that sunspot come from okay also the sun the sun will age you like nobody's business you guys so make sure you are um, protecting your skin from those sun rays you are wearing protective hats sunscreen protect the skin at all costs that is how you're going to make sure you are you know aging gracefully and also that you are not damaging your skin because sun damage is hard to reverse you know wrinkles they're hard to reverse, like unless you go cosmetic and all that stuff. So pretty much I just want to have that conversation with you guys because I even get the question here too from you guys that, you know, hey, you look so young, like how is it? And there's no like magic like to it. Um, I don't sacrifice children or anything like that for my looks or anything, but it's just, you know, um, 
genetics play a major role I feel as well genetics play a major role and then from there it's pretty much what you do you know um how you are taking care of yourself from like then on you know if you're not taking care of yourself you're gonna see it you know it's gonna show all up here okay so yeah you guys if you guys have any questions let me know leave them down below thank you so much for watching this is your name is marie make sure to rate comment subscribe all that fun stuff and i will see you guys in a later video